All right, guys, before we even download it or anything like that, let's make sure that everything's backed up. Notes and such like that will not be backed up no matter really what you do. So you can send an email of your notes to yourself by just going into any, most of the note applications and just hitting menu bar and then send and stuff like that. Uh, for the other applications, if your game progress will be not saved, things of that nature will not be saved. But there is a way to save all your application names and that's called AppList. Um, it's an app that I made and it's just, it's, it's a good reason to get it for this process too. Um, you can just search app list anywhere. Uh, let's just do search app list. And then usually it's the first one. And what it does, it pretty much saves all of your applications name list. So you can install all of them later. And our later versions will come out with better uh, stuff for it. But right now it's just a pretty basic program. Uh, all right, it's so installing. Pretty small program as well. All right, so you open it and uh, hoping that you uh, haven't used this program before, you won't have uh, the applist.txt on your computer. So once you have it here, you just hit the save applist and it stays green for a little bit when it's going through all your applications and saving the list. All right, so it's done, it's pretty quickly. And uh, let's go look at it on our computer. Uh, that's pretty much all you can really do uh, to save all your information if you're not rooted because you can't back up your apps or anything like that. Uh, your SD card will not be touched during the restore. So if you have your music and stuff like that on your SD card, don't worry about that. It's all going to be fine. And all that stuff is still going to be there next time we restore. So that's all good. Computer, And as you see, we have the app list here, dot text. Um, so here you go. If you've already installed app list and you've already done it, I recommend just doing it again. Just saving another app list. What you can do is you can rename the app list. Or what I do is I just make a list app list folder, and here are my like different dates of when I had had to restore my phone previously. So this is just a nice thing to do. And here's all the names of the apps I have installed on my phone and whatnot. So let's get to the next part, which is um, installing the 2.1 ROM. Uh, I'll send a link to where you can download it in multiple links uh, from a website that I'm getting all this information from. Uh, I just want to say thank you to Chris. He's on uh, Twitter and he's been helping me out a lot. He's finding all this great news info for me and I'm just going to try and show you guys what he's really been showing me. So um, once you have it downloaded, uh, you see it here and you just drag it into your SD card. So make sure you're not dragging it into a folder or anything like that drag it straight onto your SD card SD card slash nothing so just drag it in there should take a little bit make sure you have enough memory on your SD card uh, other than that it's uh, it's pretty simple and let's go back to the phone and uh, I'll show you how to install it on your phone alright so we have it hooked up the computer and such like that um, all right, so this is how you're really going to restore your phone. We don't really need it connected to the computer right now, so we can just take that out. Um, to turn it off, of course, you press power button. I'm hoping you've done that before. And let me just take off my case so it's a lot easier to show you guys where everything is. All right, now there's two different ways you can turn, um, restore your phone. I've done this a few times. My favorite one is just holding the... Um, the bottom volume and power button, but there's also a trackball uh, call button. So I'm just gonna hold the bottom button and the power button. And then we, here we go. And then it said SD card checking, all that stuff. I'm supposed to just track trackball. And then you see like a little loading bar. I've never done this before, so uh, yay. It looks like it's uh, doing a pretty nice job. Um, this is a 2.1 ROM only for the Droid Airs. I wouldn't try it on any phone. It might not work on any phone. So I'm not I'm not really saying uh, try it on any other phone. But yeah. Here we got the little menu bar. Uh, it says no image or wrong image. No image or wrong image. Um, yeah, so it went down the list for what it's looking for. So it went to pb00diag.zip, p 
pd blah 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 dot um three dot nhh dot nbh um idaz dot nbh iag dot nbh and then it looked for the one that is actually right all right so it's checking the zip file should be reasonably clear i don't really know where the hotspot is Right, checking now. Uh, the tutorial I was reading about just said uh, just follow the instructions, so it's pretty easy. Um, usually, restoring your phone takes a little bit. All right. Um, do you want to start the update action? Yes. All right. Oh snaps! I might have just hit. No, that's the thing, it's like, it's really sensitive. So if you turn a little bit before you hit, you might hit now, like maybe I just did. <laughs> so this is kind of annoying. All right, so either it's installing it now or I just accidentally hit now. There's no touch really, so. Oh, if you guys didn't notice, this thing kind of snapped. I know in my accessories video, I was like, oh, this thing's really strong. Well, it is, but um, if you mess with it enough, it will snap. Uh, luckily, I got two, um, so I'm going to install a second one. But right now, I'm just kind of stuck with a broken one, which is still kind of fun just playing with, you know. But it doesn't really do much anymore. All right, so it is checking it again. I'm just going to assume that I messed up. All right. Do not turn it off. On, updating, and now it's not. <laughs> now we have that. This is the logo -ish thing. crucial one. Um, don't really touch your phone at all. Um, I wouldn't really take any chances pressing any button. I, you don't really know how sensitive it is. It could just pretty you touch the power button and it turns off. So I would just don't touch anything. <laughs> um, Alright, recovering, running, zipping. If any of you guys have heard anything about new phones, I heard the supersonic Looks like sick. it didn't hit right. new. Ooh, if you guys see that, that little bottom really bar cool right here. Really cool for That's Hopefully new this in the hack store. Which course, you guys would still be watching this English. video if it didn't right. work for me. Just skip the. Because then I can uh, tell you guys never oh, to go this is to the so sick. All right. <laughs> so, um, all right. I uh, have data so. plan with your wireless network. Yes. Um, a little red bar up there. I'm hoping that means it's through my Wi Fi network. Of course, I have the coolest password right. ever. It's updating the password. system. I'm just so oh, tempted to like, hit a button and just like, screw password. everything up. All right. I, th I think this is actually 2.1, which is really cool. I'm just kind of curious, um, like, how did they get 2.1? I'm sure some, like, PR, HTC person really is stupid enough they got to send hold it of the 2.1, or they just, like, correct or the Nexus maybe 1, someone on HTC or something like that, but got a hold of it. It's 2.1 nonetheless. And was just, like, someone paid them uh, $3,000 something different, maybe 1.6. So who knows, who knows? but um, I've been waiting for 2.1 for right. a hell of a long time. Um, Do you want to reboot the device? Yes. I'll just so set rebooting. up my Google really quick big just news, so I can guys. get my contacts back. Uh, I must say, thing, if you um, rebooting after a really nice, um, your recovery contacts. does take a little bit longer. Everything has to reload again. Ooh, that's a new boot up logo. You're typing without my case. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Um, I have seen a few videos, if you haven't watched awesome. any of my latest videos, um, about what the 2.1 can really do. And uh, this is right. not a root from what I hear. Um, not sure so you cannot at all. install root applications yet, from what I know. I that was you, my this might password. be a root as well as um, it's just installing the new update. Um, as opposed to when the actual all update right. comes Signing out, I'm in. not really sure if you're going to be able to install it right off the bat, or if you're going to have to downgrade and then upgrade to the latest. Um, I'm not really sure how that's going to work. So. I'll make a video when the actual hey, 2.1 comes out, which is supposed Google to be account. the first six right. months of the beginning of the so year. So all set up now. Uh, that's not really that promising. Uh, <laughs> I'll do Twitter. All 
right.